For myself, my work is it's most successful when it's the toughest. There's just that one element you can grab onto, but you really gotta work. You can't be sure whether Joey Versosa is asking a question or making a statement with the title of his new show. One thing is certain, you're bound to have questions of your own with Is This It? at the Contemporary Art Center. Let's talk to the longtime Northern Kentucky artist and try to add some clarity to the abstract and schizophrenic nature of his artwork. It kind of exists as both. It's a question and then also as like a, a kind of an affirmation. A lot of you know, this work is going to show, especially some of the videos as it progresses in its own narrative, uh, a lot of kind of humility. I think a lot of this work, especially with This Is It, has a lot to do with the male face uh, challenging the definition of masculinity in the Midwest. Certainly it's biographical, just your basic, you know, groundworks of this life, love, death. I was also emotionally trying to work through how video, for me, how I was seeing it, so I wasn't necessarily interested in narrative. I was trying to make that image into an object because it's a time-based medium, of course. How could I somehow add some sense, uh, some frictive element to that, uh, to that time base? The sense of like real meditation of like locking in on that image, you know, presenting this sense of utopia, which ultimately due to the fact of like we just can't sit and watch those that it becomes ultimately kind of slightly dystopic, right? But you know, that it was just this lockdown repeating thing, you know, and it just, you know, it, there became this kind of prosodic nature to it that I was really interested in. He is a local artist. I think he is an international caliber artist. He makes work that is unbelievably personal and very, very moving in a way that just touches you very deeply and he works with popular culture, something that most people can relate to, but he makes it personal and open, which I think is an amazing rare skill that he has. I think his video work, working with appropriated clips is something quite new. He has done things similar in the past, drawing from video games and referencing historical works or popular culture, but he hasn't directly drawn from them before in the way that he does in this piece. And he is very much, with all his exhibitions, conceiving it as a single installation that's very immersive. And it's on a larger scale than past projects that he's done. His work is very, very nuanced, and these small seconds within his work can create a huge difference. And he has this sensitivity that I think is unbelievably rare and makes for very poignant work. For myself, my work is it's most successful when it's the toughest. There's just that one element you can grab onto. You know, that one little thing will bring you in, but you've really got to work to get to a place with it.